What's up, collectors? This is another review, this time of Transformers Masterpiece Scale Huffers. On the left, we have Bad Cube Huff, and on the right, we have Fans Toys Rig. Now, Fans Toys just recently came out, so it's the latest Huffer on the market, which means it's had time to improve upon the previous figure. To me, this was the best... Uh, Huffer out there. There's this one and the X-Transbots also has one. I felt like this one was much better. And uh, you may or may not think that this is better than the Bad Cube. It's the most expensive, uh, which is Fan Toys is known for now recently uh, because of build quality, the materials. It's usually die -ca a lot of die cast, uh, good paint applications, and uh, cartoon accuracy this one feels heavier than this one uh, this one has way more die cast this has some die cast and plastic um, people criticize the joints here where it comes out in the middle with the arms but that is how it's done in the cartoon so if you're into cartoon accuracy that's a plus for the fans toys uh, some people make a uh, criticism that sometimes fans toys they make uh metallic colors like with the warpath and sometimes they make the matte colors like with blur in this case they went with uh, metallic colors i personally like uh the bad cube colors better the lighter matte pastel colors i wish that the fans toys had this paint scheme on it it would have made this perfect um however i do like this one better uh some people like this these arms better even though that's not how it's uh cartoon accurate but uh people like the aesthetic back cube lift up the arms has waist articulation the arms that come up to the side they go up and around here the uh, the head you can move this cab back to move the head from side to side you can look up you can look down a bit can lift his leg up all the way can move it out to the side let's see you have some thigh swivel you have some tilt in the foot and you have a rocker right up to there uh, looks good from the side the close the cab here the elbows are more than 90 you get that much and the feet bend only to 90 to the fans toys here the cap doesn't move back you can move the head from side to side uh, he looks up You can look down. Well, you really can't look down much. You lift the arm up. He only goes up to there. So it's not as, as mobile as the uh, bad cube. However, it does move all the way around. You hear the ratchets. Let's see. Has waist articulation. In order to move the legs up here, you have to lift up this skirt. The bad cube, you don't have to do that. You can hear the ratchets. Now, I don't know if this can go out further, the hip skirt. It only goes up to there. Maybe this can be pulled more. I'm not sure. I don't want to stress it. But uh, it only seems to go up to there from the side. It's just a little limited that way. Close this down. There is no real tilt up and down here, although you do have rocker. If we look at it from the side here it only goes up to 90 the back cube goes up further however here the knee 
goes past 90. And we're on the back cube, it only goes to 90. So there's some more mobility and certain features on the fans toys and other features on the bad cube. Look at them from the sides. Look at them from the back. Fans toys is a lot cleaner. Here you have these tires. Don't and these heels. You don't see that on the fans toys. Bigger, a bit bigger backpack here. It's a little more compact. So the fans toys is more cartoon accurate if that matters to you and it's more clean and compact to where the bad cube is a bit bulkier bad cube fans toys now the accessories are pretty much identical on the left is bad cube on the right is fans toys both come with a card and instructions card and instructions Bad Cube comes with a big gun, a smaller gray gun, and a surprised face. Fan Source comes with the big gun. However, it comes with two little guns. So it brings one more gun than the Bad Cube. And here it brings a surprised head instead of just a face. So Fan Source has just one more gun than the Bad Cube. Anyway, there you have it. Comparison of Masterpiece Scale Huffers.